Now when you take a college class, at the end, you fill out a form about a professor, your evaluation form. What did you think of the class? What did you think of the professor? And after airborne school, you were asked, what did you think of your instructor? What did you think of the, the course? You would think, after coming back from a, a combat tour in Afghanistan, you would be filling out some paperwork. What did you think of your sergeant major? What did you think of your major? What did you think about those in the direct chain of command above you? And none of those questions were ever asked verbally, and there sure wasn't any paperwork that we had to fill out. Would you want to deploy with this unit again? Did you feel that some of these people put your lives at risk? And you know, if that person didn't get anybody killed, everything's fine. Let them go on in another mission. Until they get someone killed, they're not going to be removed from the unit, from the team, from your chain of command. There was a handful of people that I served with over there who I constantly had to double check to make sure that not only was my weapon on safe, but was their weapon on safe. Have a very good day. How does that work? And uh, enjoy your Ninja Turtle outfits. Okay? Say that. Touch a core. Look at this. Small turtle. Nice outfit. Yeah, small turtle. Did you feel that a lot of the people that you were over there with, that they didn't know how to use specific equipment? That they didn't even care? Why would I want to stay in Special Forces when a good majority of the people here are anything but special? I think I'm going to go to, uh, back to college. Those are concerns that I had. Those are concerns that I will continue to have.